hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you how to create a jQuery date picker using CDN links on a web form controls after end of this video tutorial the output will be I'm selecting the input control notice here we got a new theme to the calendar and as well as the month and the year I'm selecting the date see the date format has been changed. I am using Notepad++ for this example and in this Notepad++ contains a simple HTML code with one header tag h1. Before adding the input controls and jQuery CDN links, let's save this file. We will check the output how it looks the designing part on the browser. And this is the output of that HTML code with header tag h1. Now let's flip over to the coding part. We'll add the input control and we'll add the jQuery date picker CDN link to that control. I'm back to the coding part. After the horizontal line, I'm adding one div. Now in this div, select date, input id is equals to date picker. Let's save this file again. We'll check the output on the browser. I'm reloading the browser and here we got our output, the input control. Now my aim is when a user click the input control, it displays the jQuery date picker control to select the dates. Let's visit the jQuery official website. We'll grab the jQuery CDN links. In the Google type Ajax jQuery Google CDN. Let's click the second one hosted libraries. Now in the Google hosted libraries, click the jQuery, copy this link. And here I'm using the jQuery latest snippet code is 3.2.1 copy this. Now let's add this snippet code into my notepad plus plus. Between the header section I'm adding the code snippet. Now we need another code of jQuery user interface. For that let's switch over to the again the same we'll grab the snippet code of jQuery user interface UI code. Now this time I'm using jQuery UI click on it in jQuery UI snippet, the two links jQuery CSS and one is JavaScript. Let's copy this. Paste these two snippet links on my Notepad. After the script tag, I'm adding those both links. After adding the jQuery CDN links, I'm adding script. Closing the script. Dollar function dollar between double quotes. I am adding the input ID, which is a date picker hash dot date picker method semicolon let's save this file we'll check the output on the browser I'm back to the browser I'm reloading this browser when I click I notice here we got the jQuery date picker when I click the input control if I choose any date See it's display. Now my aim is I want to change the date format as well as the calendar control theme. For that, visit Google type ajax.aspncdn. Click the Microsoft Ajax Content Delivery Network.
click the jquery ui and click the top link jquery ui microsoft ajax cdn and here you can find different kind of themes now i want to add this hot snakes theme to my control let's copy this we'll add this link on my notepad plus plus now in the link the href just remove this css link and add the new one in the dead picker now in the dead picker i'm adding curly braces dead format between single quotes i'm adding year month date comma i want to show the month and year also change month true change year true let's save this file we'll check the output on the browser I'm reloading the browser. I'm selecting the input control. Notice here we got a new theme to the calendar and as well as the month and the year. I'm selecting the date. See, the date format has been changed. That's it. If you like this video, please leave your valuable comment, share this video and please subscribe my channel. Catch you on my upcoming videos.